party people, tinfoil hatter, back, playing some repairs. I'm gonna wrap this up, maybe. So to also, yeah, I'm wearing the, la the last of the DLC masks, which is the um, Ridge mask. Is that how you pronounce it? Creepy doll mask. The lady bears. I'm gonna see her in this episode. So yeah, I'm gonna play through. Um, well, I don't want to spoil anything. But it's the guest level and the um, final level. And both a little shorter than the normal episodes, especially the last one. So. Yeah, I'm gonna. Gonna do it all in one. I like how they have little water effects. Oh, probably add some depth to the game if you ask me. And the lighting, and just the textures in general. I say they overdid it here, but I really like it. So yes, we've got a boat. It's a cruise ship. I will put it. And someone's coming on board. See the more. It's basically like a giant submarine. Most of it's underwater, but um. Surfaces for the guests on board. Now, the surfaces once a year, as, as we can see, um, as we just saw in the last episode, they've been making food. These guys, they definitely look malnourished. They need, they need food. I think that's the only scene of game cuts, apart from, apart from between levels. Oh, and when you, and I guess when you get captured by the the dude, Roger. doesn't meet um, health and safety regulations. Oh dear. Oh dear. I don't think these people mind. I don't think... I think they have a different idea of what's socially acceptable. <laughs> I 
found most of the gnomes and statues in the game so far. I think maybe there was one or two I missed, but um, got pretty close. Got a decent, decent enough job. This this scene is kind of annoying. Moments with the kid inside, the controls kind of on your nerves. I like this weird little, it's like a little art piece. Shark! Very adorable. A bit of a French room, but you can't come here. Drawing a six in the corner there. I think the trick to this level is to run fast and keep moving, and that means they're less likely to grab onto you. Usually, I, that's never happened to me personally in my experience. But, but yeah, that, that's a throwback to the old man who is kind of a character that hasn't really showed up in the series yet, but he hides behind mirrors and spies on people. What are you doing in there? It's chopping off some fresh ingredients, I guess. Thank you. 
weird. So we've got a guest bed here. Then and then in one of the rooms downstairs the chef is chopping up fresh ingredients. about what's going on here. He's probably wearing a mask because he's so freaky looking. Nobody knows it. And sex is just fine between his hobbies. Oh dear. Give me some space, guys. I don't really like parties. I don't like I don't like bits. That's just me, but really not a fan of them. bother with me. Yeah. <laughs> that hat. I, mean, I think some of the guests were wearing them, but it mostly it look, kind of looks like what the dude um, mostly appeared from the front. You only saw them on their own ground. Most of the Yes. So maybe he's come upstairs to look for me. Yeah, that's what the mall kind of looks like. Inside. Look, got some friends. Thank you. Oh. Good about that. I might be surprised. I, I actually feel quite miserable. I'm, I'm not a fan of that at all. Oh god. I think it's kind of fitting. I'm dressed up. of all this. So 
so far this place kind of looks like um kind of looks like I'm just place but it's not it's got pictures of ferryman he's from the comics and that kind of looks like the bellman the ferryman is the one that brings most of the kids to the moor Yeah, kind of, the wallpaper looks like his, just, um, it's not the same. saying this right, his paintings are definitely of sex, I mean, at some point, at the, she was here at the war, she was, well, I don't know if she was friends with the lady, and I live here with her. I'll bet she heard that. I'll bet she's... Most of the trinkets in this game so far. It's just a couple that I missed. has always been super easy. Sean roasts me and my screw up. Lighting and stuff in this game, it's good. I am a fan. The mirrors are broken. Found you. Found you a good one. No need to thank me. See, this is the 
only real boss fight in this account down to Australia. I'd say. I'd say it's alright. I mean, it's pretty easy once you know what you're doing. the lady sort of standing there being spooky.
this way the gnomes show up? Yes, yes, I was about to say. Give me a second, I just want to count them before I get there. Probably missed a couple. That was a nightmare. It was a lot of fun. It's one of those games I can replay quite a few times. I still enjoy it, which is pretty good. I reckon. Um, I am going to be playing the DLC. I need to decide to breach chapter to get into this one. Everybody on the planet has already played this game. Um, for all the big names don't need to introduce you. It was worth. I like playing it. I like playing it over and over again. Well, over and over again. I, I don't mean. Many is. Uh, I know they're like dedicated. It's one of those things like the like Five Nights at Freddy's is dedicated to every channel and stuff. I must have played the game hundreds of times. Not hundreds, I don't know. Yeah, that would be overkill. Um, but yeah, they've played it dozens of times just to find all the secrets and whatnot. I missed a few secrets in this playthrough, but I think I did okay overall. Yeah, I, I think this game is pretty good for being ambiguous, but still um, knowing how to tell a good story. Even really say that's all, folks, because it's not. It's um, this is sketchy. No, because I haven't played the DLC yet, so can't can't wrap up the series here. I kind of can. I'll be playing more of this game soon. So. It's my my city. That is my city. I know. I know England. I know. I know science. Even though it also has a lot of yeah, scenes with ambient noise, the music doesn't, doesn't play very often.
dancing. Can't even hum uh, humble over. Is it? I should. I should try. I love this tune. This means there's heebie jeebies. Um, haven't had any um, comics. I don't know if they've been discontinued. I haven't had much of an update on them in ages. They had the first two issues, and it was about six hiding out of the war. So clearly, clearly she's been there for a bit before she escaped. And Anyway, she finds a bunch of other kids that were taken before, but they escaped. They've been hiding out um, in the depths of the moor. They kind of swap stories about the outside world and how they got there. And I thought I would really add something to the series. But I don't know what's happened to that, I don't know if it's still going. If anyone knows the news, that would be good to hear. Yeah, I saw on Twitter someone someone asked them when we'd be getting more DLC for the game after, after Secrets of the Moor was done. And they said, why stop there? We should give you a new game. Yeah, there's gonna be a sequel. I really hope there is. I'll play the hell of that. I'll definitely play it on here. So yeah, that's the moor. That's what it looks like. Much of the year. I don't wanna... Yeah, thanks. No problem. Thank you. Thank you guys at home for watching. And uh, see you in the next video. Bye.